The Lost Diadem of Ravenclaw. So it was founded in the late 10th century. Its ability is it enhances a person's wisdom. A Horcrux vi victim of the Lost Diadem of Ravenclaw was a citizen of Albania. Etched upon the surface of the diadem, it says, wit beyond measure is man's greatest treasure. The diadem has a blue sapphire that is shaped like an oval in the very center. Rowena Ravenclaw died shortly after her daughter Helena Ravenclaw stole the diadem. So the gray lady, that is Helena Ravenclaw, who is the daughter of Rowena Ravenclaw, Helena envied Rowena, so she stole the diadem to become wiser. To see her daughter one last time, Rowena Ravenclaw, before her deathbed, sent the bloody baron that was in love with Helena Ravenclaw to find her. In Albania, Helena hid the diadem. This is actually the same area where Lord Voldemort was in hiding during his exile after the first wizarding war. Helena did refuse to return with the bloody baron and he stabbed her. Horrified by his act, the bloody baron did commit suicide by stabbing himself as well. The diadem was said to be lost at this point, so it became the lost diadem. Years later, Tom Riddle managed to persuade the Grey Lady to find its location, and he retrieved it from Albania. After Riddle found the diadem, he transformed it into a horcrux by killing an Albanian citizen, and then chose to hide it in the room of requirement the night he returned to Hogwarts to request to be the new professor of defense against the dark arts. The diadem was noticed by Harry Potter in his sixth year and described as a discolored old tiara in which in 1998 Harry, Ron, and Hermione did track down the diadem with the information from the Grey Lady and retrieved it and the diadem was destroyed when Crab conjured Fiendfire and failed to control it upon its retrieval.